Hey guys, I got you. It's not Michelle. Today is actually Jayla's channel. Just kidding. I am going to be doing a video today on my mom's channel doing a back switch from my Bosphore pochette of Louis Vuitton to my new Dooney and Burke that I just got. We just got back from a cruise. We went to Belize and Cosmel, Mahogany Bay. It was a great time, but on the way back, because we docked in Florida, we stopped at the Dooney and Burke bag, Dooney and Burke store, and my mom got me this little cute little crossbody, just for a little fun. This is a crossbody too. I am a crossbody girl, what can I say? What can I say? Okay, so I have not, I have not, I have not cleaned out this bag did anything to this bag since these trips. Let's see what we find. Here we go. Okay, so maybe I should start with just taking everything out. So first- Can I see the inside of your bag? Let's see the inside of my bag. So here, you know, it's already not looking too good. What can I say, guys? Um, you just see a whole lot of papers, but we'll get in there. It's a deep dive in the little pocket. So <laughs> here we go. So I have some earrings, an empty pack of gum. Show the camera what you're pulling out. An empty pack of gum. Good to know my breath at one point did smell good. Here we go. Half of a charger. You're not showing us. There you go. Uh, this is a check for my job. Shout out to Empire Pizza. Um, an envelope with my name on it for my tips. Again, my job. I have a converter for my phone. A whole charger, just in case my half a charger fails. Chick-fil-A mints. Gotta love it. Some Motives red lipstick. This will stay on your lips forever. Of my wallet, it's Louis Vuitton. It's a cute little open upper. Uh, this is Kat Von D brown lipstick. Obviously, I'm a lipstick girl as well. What's the color of your lipstick? There's a name on there. Yes, this is Crucif. A portable charger. Um, oh, this is Victoria's Secret Plump Me Lip. I don't really use it for the plump, but it's a nude color. So if you put it on, it looks like a gloss. I'm a fan. A tampon. You never know. Always got to be safe, ladies. Uh, this is from the cruise. It's a bee thing. I had just wrapped it around. I guess I shoved it in my pocketbook. Pinto beans in a little black eyed peas. Black eyed peas in a little container. So here's the story. They say that if you always keep black eyed peas in your pocketbook or anything you carry, your money will never be low. I pulled out my tips and a check, so I'm here to say I support it. And some eye drops. Clear eyes, red relief, because on the cruise, the salt water kept getting to my contacts and my eyes kept turning red. In this little pocket up here, we have, what is this? Oh. Uh, last December, this December that just passed, we went to Las Vegas and we took a plane. So, again, did not clean out my pocketbook. I'm so glad you're here to see my trash, guys. This was a card I got from Muscle Factory. I've been on the skinny queen journey, going to the gym. Had to get a little protein shake because CarMax, as always, glossy lips, glossy life. Some Sonic mints. I'll put them with my Chick-fil-A mints. <laughs> I have a pen, just in case. Hair tie, a lot of hair, and a converter to an aux cord that I did not even know I had. So yes, this is a little 
tag that I got when I got one of my Louis Vuitton little charms. The lady always writes a little note on it. Put that over here. So now it's time for the switch. Here we go. So this is the Journey and Burke little cross bag. This is what it has this little pocket that goes all the way down. And I think the bag is called the Camera Cross Body in the Safiano leather. I shared it on my channel if you watch my videos where I purchased the steel blue for myself. And I mentioned that I got my daughter a mauve one. This is the mauve. Okay, so inside, it looks like this, and it does have this little pocket. Oh, I have already started to move some stuff. In this pocket, I already put some wet ones. I am a messy girl. I have to keep them. I need them in my life. And more tampons. So I'm going to put those back in this little zipper pocket at the back. And zip that up. This thing comes with two whole deep pockets. They go all the way down to the bottom as well as the center. So I'm sure all my stuff will fit. Let's start off with the wallet. Putting it all the way down. Gotta have the beans. Got to have the beans. Um, we'll put the plumper in one of these side pockets. We can't see. Oh, uh, the side pocket. The earrings, just in case I'm trying to sass it up in the other side pocket. Lipsticks. They're going in the middle. My portable charger. I don't know what kind of brand this is. This will charge your phone like 20 times. It never dies. It's a great time. Put that in there. You could probably stand your wallet up in the charger. Wait, it goes like that. Okay. Ah. Okay. okay. Mints just in case. Mints just in case. I'm just going to throw those in the center wherever they go. I'm not going to put this gum packet back in my bag, y'all. It's empty. It's no good. Um, a tampon can never have too many. Let's put this in the zipper pocket. Because you know people love opening your bag. The guys will be surprised. Their feelings will be hurt. Hair ties, side pocket. Um, I'm gonna keep this pin up front just because my job, I always need to pin really quick. And those pins, they're paper made. They're really good about not spilling. I would never put my bag in danger like that. Take a moment of silence for all the dead bags. <laughs> okay, here we go. So the chargers, I'm only gonna put one in there. I'm not really sure where that second charger came from. Maybe shout out to my mom for letting me steal her charger. Absolutely. Um, my converter. My aux converter. Really, at this point, I'm just shoving these things in here and seeing if it's going to fit. Carmax. I am going to put these back in here because I will lose them if I don't put them somewhere that I can grab them immediately. Oh, and my red eye relief. I'll probably put it. No, I'll put it in here. So before I started shoving these things in here, this is what my bag looked like. Ugh. Okay. So I have in there is my wallet, my portable charger, a couple of char one charger, my lipsticks, my glosses, wipes, they're in the back pocket, tampons, Oh, my clay and my keys, uh, they're all connected. They are downstairs, but they're just going to fit right on top because there's plenty of room in here. This bag looks small, but it has a hefty bite. They'll go like right there on top because I always just grab them when I need them really quick. So curious, if you took your wallet and your portable charger and stood them up, how much room would it give you? Like sit them up back to back. Yeah. So if I stand them up side to side, I mean back to back right here, oh, I have this whole corner mm -hmm. over here that's just for like my free glosses that I shoved in there. 
I'm about to shove this charger in there. The only thing about packing a bag like that is when she takes her wallet out of her portable charger, something may fall in that spot and she'll have to move it over to put it back. I was just curious if the height would fit, and it does. She has plenty of room to the top. Plenty of room. So she cute. She's stylish. She's soft. Dooney and Burke, they did it for me. Okay, so if you like this video or you like my mom's channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share the love. You know, we're all about the love. And um, yeah, thank you for joining me.